I believe too. And with that, there's only one thing left to say. Let's rev it up! Alright, welcome back. Um, I'm going to show you guys what I mean, uh, an example of how Trick Clown can be useful. Because sometimes you're gonna be you're gonna be in that situation where you just need a level four. I mean, of course, a jet warrior um, aids in that situation where you have a formula and a, and a librarian, but you need a you need to make a level six. And when you, if you draw if you have quick draw, quick draw can give you the level four that you need because you'll level eat it and then level eat into what's it called um, into coral and charge but um, sometimes you don't have quick draw so this 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 is what I mean how what you see exactly what I mean as soon as you as soon as you draw into it look at boom there that it gives you the six the four that you need to make a six and um, this is a quick, a quick replay I want to show you guys and then I'll, I'll show you guys a little bit of uh, some variations of, of the with actual cards hang on okay let me show let me show what I mean so okay like okay normally you would like um, I have these dice here to because okay, if I put it anywhere here, it'll be, uh, it'll be uh, what's them call it? It'll be uh, it's a glare. So I use these as guides to put around it, okay, around the thing. But anyways, okay, like let me show what I mean. Okay, let's say you're you're so there's times sometimes when you have to do this play where, like you saw in the video, you'll have like a, a librarian and then you'll you'll have like a. Um, formula sometimes one sometimes two it, it, it really depends and you're just hoping to draw into uh, a quick draw and a level leader like you're, you're hoping to draw into this right like this is what you're hoping to do so you can pitch it and then um, like special it oh, this is really bugging me okay, so, okay. I just, I just, I just don't want to be all blurry, oh, uh, oh, uh, what's it called? Oh, uh, glare. Okay, so, uh, and normally what you want to do is you want to go like that, and then that'll give you the jet. Um, hang on, I'll just put it this way, like that. Boom. There, is that better? Should be a little bit better. Just get out of the glare. Have all this space when I why not use it right <laughs> okay so and this is the scenario you want to be in but sometimes there's those chances where you, there's a time when, when you don't draw this like you, you just you just don't draw into it so in in my logic the way I saw it I was like oh if, what if you just top tick this and th that gives you your six and then yeah and then you just continue to go on from there and it's just another pressure like it just gives you another special summon because sometimes you lose steam on that part because if you don't have quick draw but you need something else to special summon but i don't know like it, it opens up plays to have this um and and that it just gives you like a nine if you have glow bulb or something or uh, let's say you want to bait something out first um you um you send level eater and then you just uh, it just gives you something uh, something to work with and then also um, today, I, today I found out because I was looking at um, oh, what's that guy's channel? Uh, I'll, 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 I'll see if I can post it to the, uh, the channel of the, the thing. But um, I saw that there was a new new spell card. It was called Necroid Synchro. It's like it's like the way I saw it was like um, Synchro's uh, instant fusion because all you do is uh, you 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 banish um, you banish a tuner any like any tuner and then. It has to be um, up to two um, non-tuners, and then you so you banish them, and then you you special summon a synchro from your extra deck uh, that matches that level of that banish of that banish thing. So like, it has to be a start of, a start of synchro though. So you can bring out. Um, I mean, you can't bring. Really, I guess you can bring out him, but like, let's say you change your your extra deck around, you can you can bring out Stardust, you can bring out um, Cipher Dragon. Uh, you can bring out any any Stardust, uh, star, um, I think Spark, Stardust, Spark Dragon, Stardust. Uh, yeah, so I, I think it's gonna be pretty cool. It's, it's gonna be interesting because you can just you can like special it from your extra deck and then just level lead it, and then uh, make formulas 
and then what's gonna call it um and then um just synchro with it and make a quasar out of that or just it just it'll, it'll just come out as a beater um like you just, yeah you just bring out like bring a starter spark and it's just a four thousand beater like you just bring out by just uh, just banishing because you you, you flip your grave so much and so easy and I'm assuming you can banish any tuner so it, you can banish even quick draw I think I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure you can so you can banish quick draw and like um, see I don't know like oh man I don't know that like, you don't play any twos <laughs> but yeah and like it it, it it just opens up possibilities it opens up much better and I don't know. I, I think I think it'd be pretty cool, especially if, if you utilize it with uh, with that new spell card, the grass is greener or grass is tastier. That one grass card that was called um, lawn mowing. I think that's gonna be insane. Like you just mill and then you just draw that, and then because you you'll you'll want to go into what's it called um, uh, left arm offering, get it from your deck, and then. A lot more than I don't know. I think there's this a lot of options you can do. It seems like it, it's gonna be pretty cool because that's like our instant fusion, it's, it, it's similar. It's not nor it's not Norden, but it's like the way I see it is I think it's, in, it's an instant fusion. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty, pretty cool, but yeah, um, I just wanted to show you guys that little that, that little bit because it's something you can do. And I have stage two tomorrow, so uh, oh my god, I wish you luck tomorrow because I, I I came up with a build that I think it's uh, a, a bit better. It's more consistent to where um, I kind of got sidetracked. That I was trying I was trying to trying to com combat the meta a bit too much, and it just stirred it steered me away from what the deck is meant to actually do. So hopefully, the little changes I made. Uh, it's gonna make up for what I was trying to trying to get around, but yeah, because oh my god, if I do, yeah, and, and it's much better with the mic, because like before, I had to be like kind of restrain myself, like 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 before, like I couldn't like be too loud or like it'll just like peak, and so I had like throughout the videos, like now and then I would, I would kind of get overexcited and just like speak up, but now I can actually like like not worry about it peaking. So that's gonna be that's gonna be pretty cool because I can I, I, I don't have to restrain myself, <laughs> but yeah that's gonna be uh yeah that that's it <laughs> thank you for watching.